Isi kuvamia makazi ya mwanawe Rais Mustafa Uhuru Kenyatta na kuibua hasira za kiongozi huyo, serikali ya Kenya kwanza imejibu la lama za Uhuru na kumwambia kinaganaga hakuna kiongozi yeyote aliyejuu ya sheria. Kenya kwanza umetaja uvamizi huo presheni ya kiusalama ukiuhusisha familia ya Uhuru na ufadhili wa maandamano ya upinzani. Wakati huo huo azimio umeshtumu vikali uvamizi huo wakimlaumu Rais Ruto kwa kutumia polisi kuhangaisha na kuhujumu Uhuru wa viongozi wa upinzani. Oh, Siku moja baada ya polisi kuvamia makao ya mwanawe Rais Mustafa Uhuru Kenyatta na kuibua hasira za Rais huyo wa nne, mrithi wake Rais wa sasa William Ruto na ujumbe wake walitua maeneo ya vihiga na kisi kwa ziara ya maendeleo. Siasa za uvamizi huo wa jana zikitawala mawimbi maeneo haya. Rais Ruto na wendani wake wakimrushia vijembe na kumkejeli Rais Mustafa Uhuru Kenyatta kwa kilio chake kufuatia tukio hilo. Mimi nimewaambia hao watu wa kupanga maandamano wawache mchezo. Nimewaambia wawache mchezo. Kama wanataka maandamano, kwanza warudishe watoto wao wamewapeleka kule bunge ya East Africa. Na waweke bibi zao na watoto wao mbele ya maandamano. Wasitumie watoto na familia ya watu wengine kufanya maandamano na watoto wao wako nyumbani. Hiyo ni upuzi. Simuliona wengine jana wakilalamika. Ati watoto hao wanasumbuliwa. Na wewe umeweka bunduki ishirini kwa nyumba. Ni vita gani unapigana na bunduki ishirini kwa nyumba yako? Unalia eti mama yako anasumbuliwa. Kwani sisi hatuna mama zetu? Wakitaja kuvamiwa kwa makao ya mwanawe Kenyatta kama operesheni ya kiusalama. Wandani wa Ruto wamezidi kuhusisha familia Rais Mustafa Uhuru Kenyatta na maandamano yanayoshuhudiwa nchini na kumtaka akimie hadi polisi wamalize uchunguzi wao. Some of those licensed gun owners are the ones who are giving their arms and their firearms to go and kill innocent people in the streets and put it on the police that it is the police that are executing people. Yet it is you who are executing our people so that you can blame our police and see if you can instigate insurgency in Kenya. Kikosi cha azimio kwa upande wao kimeshutumu vikali hatua ya polisi kuvamia makazi ya mwanawe Uhuru Kenyatta. Kikosi hicho kimemtaka Rais Ruto kukoma kuhangaisha Rais huyo na viongozi wengine upinzani. The withdrawal of security of his mother, Mama Ngena Kenyatta. The attack on his son, Jomo by uniformed police claiming to be police and the attack and vandalization of the Kenyatta family Northrad's farm. These are all acts of grave provocation, not only to Uhuru Kenyatta and his family, but also to all right-thinking Kenyans. Azimio, wanalalama kufikia sasa baadhi ya viongozi wake hawajulikani walioko baada ya kutiwa nguvuni na serikali. In the magnanimous aspects of the high court the high court extended those orders and said that whoever is holding my jenga in whichever police station that is being held in the OCS upon receipt of these orders be ordered to raise my jenga with a bail of 100,000 shillings so when we went to serve the orders of Abia's Corpus at the Central Police Station, the police refused us to access the police station. As mere readers are being put at the house arrest, constant surveillance and persistent threat of being arrested. We demand the unconditional release of all the Azimio readers and supporters who are still being held in communicado. Swali ni je, ni ipi hatuma ya mikoruzano hii ya kisiasa? Edgar Wabwire Lookup TV.